Happy birthday, big guy. Got a two-week gig here in Port Hope. Good luck. So how was school today? Mike. Fine. Derek, why do you lie to me? They phoned this afternoon. You weren't there. Again. If they keep bugging me, I'm leaving. Where would you go? Port Hope. I got this yesterday from my dad. My birth dad. My real dad. It's real acid? Oh, it's incredible, man. It takes maybe half an hour before I feel anything, and it gets to you, and you're flying, man. Yeah. I love it. I'm taking off. Running away? You have to promise me you won't tell anyone. You don't have to take it if you don't want to. I'm not chicken. Thanks for stopping. Where are you headed, son? Port Hope. I'm going that way. Hop in. Great. I went to a concert last night with Shane McKay. Is that right? Mm-hmm. Had he taken any drugs? No. He doesn't do that stuff. I don't know anyone who does that stuff. You got a girlfriend, Wheels? No. So you never fooled around, eh? <laughs> no. What are you doing? Relax. It doesn't hurt, does it? Get away from me! Joey! Hey, Snake! Wheels called yet? No. What if something happened? Snake, he's only been gone for one night. What do you mean, only? When was the last time you were out all night? Snake, relax. He's okay. I don't know. I think we should tell someone. No way! We gotta hang tough. We promised. I don't break promises. His grandmother called him last night. See if I knew where he was. Joey, she was crying. I felt terrible. I know. She called me, too. OK, if he doesn't call us tonight, we'll tell someone. OK? OK. okay. I'm on top of that. A cop came in my house. That was for wheels? It's for Shane. He didn't come home from the concert. You know, Shane, you probably messed up with Shane. I couldn't believe it. I bet Shane's just run away. You think so? So horrible. My mom actually likes these awful pictures. She wants to send a copy to everyone. I'm being punished. I know it. For what? I don't know. Maybe I did something horrible in a past life. Hey, Luke. You were at the concert on Saturday. Do you know what happened to Shane? No, I don't. Leave me alone, okay? Yeah. Sure. Sorry. Maybe Shane got kidnapped. Don't say that. Joey. Hi. Do you still want help with math after school? Yeah, sure, if you don't mind. No. Great. Did you hear about Shane? Yeah, pretty terrible, huh? Good morning. I gather that some of you have heard that Shane has disappeared. The police have asked me to inquire if anyone has any information to please come forward to them or to a member of the staff. Is a very serious situation. Happy birthday, big guy. For me, things are going great. Got a two week gig here in Port Hope. Good luck, Mike.
Yes, can I help you? Yeah, um, I'm looking for Mike Nelson. Um, he's with the band. Yeah. I'm his son. Room seven, through that door and up the stairs. Thanks. It's me, Derek. Derek? Derek! Hey, I've missed you, man. What are you doing here? I sort of run away. Too many hassles, right? Hey, I understand. You still play bass? Yeah. Far out. You can practice with us. Maybe you can be our bass player. Great! Good to see you, big guy. Really? Because I was kind of worried you wouldn't want to see me. You kidding me? We belong together. Ever since your parents died, I wanted you here. From now on, it's you and me against the world, okay? Yeah, okay. Who is it? It's me, Derek. Derek? Derek. What are you doing here? I came to see you. Where's your parents? They're dead. They got killed in a car crash last fall. Sorry, I didn't know. Uh, where are you living? With my grandparents. What are you doing here? I came to see you. Mm -hmm. Uh, you had breakfast yet? Uh, wait downstairs. Uh, I just, I gotta be down in a while. Hello, Luke. Do you remember me? Yeah. Last time we met, you said, he doesn't do that stuff. I don't know anyone who does that stuff. We were talking about drugs. Honest, we don't do that stuff. We found Shane. We found him below a bridge. It looks like he jumped. Or perhaps he fell. Is he all right? He's alive, Luke. Barely. He's in the hospital. Will he be okay? I'm afraid it's too soon to say. Now, I want you to tell me the truth. We've talked to a lot of people, Luke. We have reason to believe he was on drugs. Maybe he took some acid, okay?
Where are your grandparents? They don't know I'm here. I came by myself. How'd you get here? I hitchhiked, and then I walked. You ran away? Man, they'll be worried sick. No, they won't. They don't want me. Derek, you gotta call him. You gotta let him know you're all right. If I call him, then can I stay? If you call, we'll talk. Hey, Lloyd. Yeah? Okay, if my kid uses your phone, it's long distance. I'll pay. Hello? Hi, Grandma. It's me. Derek. Oh, thank goodness. Where are you? Are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine, Grandma. Honest. See you in there. You want coffee? Coming home? Milk and sugar? Derek? You coming home? No, I'm not. And I can't tell you where I am. So don't come and look for me. Derek, we have to know. Your granddad and I are worried so. Just tell Joey I'm okay. But tell me where you are. I have to know Bye, where Grandma. you are. Derek, don't hang up. Hello? Hello? He's gone. What was that he said about Joey? So, they said I can stay. They weren't worried? They're cool. So, can I stay? Look, you sent me this. Doesn't it mean anything? Sure. I can help with the band. Carry stuff. You're my real dad. We're blood. And I don't have anywhere else to go. Please? Okay. Just for today. Then we gotta figure something out. Listen, I got some things I gotta do. Seeing as I'm up already. You stay here, okay? Okay. Uh, when will you be back? In a while. Good to see you, big guy. From now on, it's you and me against the world, okay? Yeah, okay. The purpose of writing is to make your reader feel something. But you can make him feel something not by just what you write, but also by the way in which you write it. Could Joey Jeremiah please come to the office? Go. What did I do? I don't know. Go. All right, knock it off. <laughs> you can make them feel something not by just what you write, but the way you write it. How many people know what calligraphy is? Very good. Doris, you wanted to see me? Joey, I've heard from Derek. He's all right. Really? You know where he is, don't you? No, I, I don't. Please, Joey. He's my only grandchild. I'm worried sick about him. Please? Please? Yeah, I think I know where he is.
thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very hey, much. Hey, what are you doing in here? Put that down. Sorry, I was just looking at it. How'd you get in here? You think you could just come in off the street and goof around? I didn't break anything. Get out of here. This isn't a place for kids. Take it easy, Josh. This is my kid. Serious? Yeah. Sorry. I thought you were just some punk off the street, but don't touch the equipment, OK? I wouldn't break anything. I play bass. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I've played for over a year. Over a year? Oh, well, you're a real pro, then. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you're no prize yourself some nights, Josh. <laughs> you didn't tell me anything about the kid. Yeah, he's just here for the day. Then you might have run away from home. Watch out, Mike. Tough stuff. exercises six to ten. Remember, you may use a compass and straight edge to copy line segments and angles. They can also be used to bisect the angle. Does everyone understand that? Okay, before you go, Nancy has a card for you to sign. Yeah, it's a get well card for Shane, and Tim and I are taking it to him in the hospital this afternoon if you'd like to come and sign out. or something. Someone told me that Shane was in a coma. Are you serious? Yeah. What room is it? Dr. Chandler. 438. Dr. Turner in OR. Oh, there's 436. Dr. Billy Chandler. Chandler. Mr. McKay? This is from the kids at school. Thank you. Is he going to be all right? No one knows. We hope so. He hasn't regained consciousness yet. Thank you for coming. I know he'll appreciate it. Will you pray for him? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Got a visitor, Mike. Hi. I thought you said you were sending him back. I couldn't just tell him to hit the road. Michael, he's a missing kid. He can stay for today. He's a good kid. You'll like him. I'll introduce you to him. Come on. Derek, this is Maggie. Hello. Hi. We're getting married. She's pregnant. Yeah. I know it's traditional to get married first. But when was the last time I ever did anything traditional? Ah, I'm starved. You guys feel like some pizza? Hey, Joss, want some pizza? Yeah, sure. Double cheese? Anchovies? You feel like anchovies, don't you, Derek? You're going to keep it, aren't you? What? The baby, when it comes. You're not going to throw it away like you threw me away. It wasn't like that. No? No. Me and Cindy, we were too young. We weren't ready to be parents. Hey, 
these. I'm looking for a young man. Derek, listen. We were 16. He's two years older than you. One year. Well, what kind of father do you think you'd make right now? It wouldn't be fair to the baby. I wouldn't throw it away. We didn't throw you away. We made sure you got a good home. Derek! 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 Who's this? I'm so glad I found you. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. Well, come. Come, let's go home. I don't want to go home. Derek, it's where you belong. Yeah, right. So you can put me in a group home? Derek, that's not true. It hasn't been decided. If you start back to school... I don't want to go to school. And I don't want to live with you. I want to stay here with Mike. Michael, he can't stay. So you're the birth father? Yeah. This boy has nothing to do with you anymore. Nothing. Michael, he can't stay. He's a teenager. We can barely afford to take care of ourselves, and we have the baby coming. Who says he's staying? You have no rights in this matter at all. My husband and I have been legally appointed to take care of this boy. You, you could be sent to prison. What are you talking about prison? Look, I didn't ask him to come here. I told you you should have called the police. Look, I don't know what you want. I want you to leave this boy alone. What about me? You all talk about what you want. What about what I want? Wait! Derek! Michael, I told you this isn't any of our business. My kid, I feel responsible. It's not any... Derek! Wait! Leave me alone. I want you to come back with me. I'm not going back. Sure, keep running. Where are you going to go? What do you care? Can't you stop for five minutes and realize that we love you? No, you don't. You don't want me. No one wants me. No one cares about me. You selfish, selfish little boy! Your grandfather and I just want to help you! We really do. We know we're not your parents. I just wish they were dead. I still miss them so much. Well, Derek. I want so to do I. I want them back, Grandma. <laughs> So do I. I want them back. <laughs> I bet Shane's really okay. He's just pretending to be hurt. Yeah, so he doesn't get in trouble. He is not faking. We saw him, remember? He looks terrible. I don't know if he'll ever recover. So a triangle and its transformation image are always going to be congruent, right? Right. But what about this Euchre guy? Euclid. He says that given two sides of a triangle and the included triangle, that means that it's impossible to draw two triangles that aren't congruent. He figured that out? Uh-huh. Why? <laughs> I'll see you inside. OK. Hey, Joey. Hey, Snake. Nothing much. Hey, look who's back. It's Wheels. 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 Where'd you get back? Last night, my grandmother drove me. Listen, um, about your grandmother, I'm really sorry. She made me tell her. She did. She's tough. It's OK. I'm glad you told her. So they're making you come here now, huh? I sort of told my grandma I'd try school again. For today, at least. Uh, hey, uh, since you're away in Port Hope to see your daddy, you've probably forgotten a lot about the grass. Yeah, maybe we should uh, show you around. 
Joey Jeremiah, Chairman of the Welcoming Committee, at your service. All right. <laughs>